what's up guys uh, welcome back this is my boy gear adam's link how are you not doing now uh, welcome to another video uh good morning good afternoon good evening depending on where you guys are watching this video from and please do not mind the face i know it's a very handsome and uh, sexy face and uh you may have possibly not seen this kind of face before in your life <laughs> so let's jump right into the uh topic guys and uh, thank you for tuning in firstly let's talk about onto dk she just revealed that she's sick she has been battling uh illness for a long time now and uh i think we wish her all the best man she said i am 38 years old woman with bad heart she doesn't mean like wicked at all bad heart that means yeah she has heart problem this is not fun nor do i like it here but it's my third day and i can only say i breathe better my pulse is open my blood is pumping and i am in pain but i have goals i have a dream to live long and healthy for my son she says she has a bad heart it's not funny at all for her. She has been healed and she has goals. And of course, to live long for her son. Well, that is quite really uh, heartfelt and uh, painful. So I think the, the best thing that you can do for Toto DK is just to pray. And uh, just pray for our guys. Ask God to kindly see her through. And also, if possible, renew her heart. We have seen miracles before of people getting new heart, new highs, new liver. Miraculously, it's not as if doctor touched them. Miraculously, somebody will just go to church or just in his house and uh, God will send an angel to change his heart or any part of his body we have, we have seen miracles like that and meanwhile check out this lovely couple this young man with a really handsome smile and this young lady with a really beautiful smile of course seeing them standing this way you will think that they are very very decent at least the girl i can tell she's decent because she's the victim here why the boy of course you can tell that she is really decent as well but <laughs> it's far from decent i don't know what actually occurred what happened between these two but something horrible happened a few days ago this guy had a quarrel with his girlfriend one thing led to another and this guy ended up caputing this girl and to make things worse the first thing this guy did was to take his phone to record the scene and post it on Instagram. <laughs> After doing the evil deed, he took his phone to record the lifeless body and posted it on Instagram. Is that not too much? Is that not too much? Well, if you want to see the video, you know where to go, guys. Head over to my Telegram at Adam Slink Media or at Adam Slink Media Channel. Or better still, you're going to see the link on my description below. Try as much as possible to check it out. Very, really horrible video, guys. I don't even want to view it twice after viewing it once. Then now uh, let's check out what uh, a popular uh, France, no popular UK uh, musician, J House, has to say about whiskey. I don't know what whiskey. I don't know the beef between him and whiskey, but he was doing a freestyle recently, and he said, "I know Bonner Boy, but I do not know whiskey." Clap man first, ask questions later. I know Burner Boy, I don't know Whiskey. Draw for his tool, he will turn a boy lick. I know Burner Boy, I don't know Whiskey. 
Well, even mentioning whiskey name, the facts already remain. You already know whiskey. <laughs> How do you know there's a name called whiskey? If you claim you do not know whiskey. Huh? That is a doubt. You are doubting yourself if you know whiskey. How do you even know there's a name called whiskey? How? That, that means you have heard of it. In fact, he's a whiskey fan. Check out this video of him listening to whiskey songs. Do like this. If I tell you, do like that. Take him to the left, though. Thank well, that's him. I listening to whiskey. So I don't know the beef between them for saying that he no boner boy, but he do not know whiskey. That is that's a low blow you better respect yourself die face your front face your face then you guys know we discuss about pet edoche and honey of ife so my discussion was that according to what viewers were saying that pet edoche insulted disrespected honey of ife by shaking hands with him and not prostrating like normal like not bowing down like normal uh, uh like how nigerians will bow down to uh, to a king so i have gone back to reason the thing all over again let's be honest if these our kings travel out of nigeria and they meet other nationals they shake hands with them when they meet delegates from abroad they shake hands nobody bow down for anyone they shake hands with them. Like this picture you are seeing now of only of you shaking hands with, uh, with a white official. Then, it's not only Pete Doshe that shook hands with only of Ife. Kanayo uh, Kanayo also did that. Otedola, Femi Otedola also shook hands. In fact, only of Ife used his two hands to shake Femi Otedola. Femi Otedola brought, us, brought out his, his hand and only of Ife used his two hands as form of respect to shake Femi Otedola. So the bottom line is that that place wasn't his jurisdiction. That place that he was wasn't his palace. He was outside his palace. If Peto Doce was visiting only of Ife at his, in, in his own house, I believe Peto Doce we prostrate for only of Ife because he's visiting the house. Likewise, any other person, but as long as he's not in his palace, he's outside his palace, then we can be counted as equal. Well, so the old talk about Peto Doce disrespecting only of Ife, I think by now you guys should chill, relax. And let it just die like that. Nobody is disrespecting anybody. It's just the way it is. No one is disrespecting anyone. That's just how it is, guys. And meanwhile, <clears throat> talking about Petro Duce, y'all and uh, his second wife are still posting videos. In fact, they posted this video of them uh, praising God nor in the act of worshipping and they're appreciating God. <laughs> well, I know you guys will be so, so angry watching the video. But make I find when I trouble small. I'm going to post the video and uh, you guys enjoy the video and uh, kindly leave your comment below and tell me exactly how you feel. Bye, guys. <laughs> I have never seen the Lord changing. Sister. Have you seen? No, 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 since I was born. I have never seen the Lord changing. Baby, have, have you seen? No, 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 I have never seen the Lord changing. Don't to accord it. Since I was born, till now I am getting old. I have never seen the Lord changing. Imela, Imela, oh Imela, thank you Jesus. Imela, Jehovah, Imela, Imela, oh Imela, Imela, Imela.
Mandela, Jehovah Mandela. So, Jesus need the man, only God is the only mediator. Jesus need the man, only God is the only mediator. Jesus need the man.